what is going on guys welcome back to a brand new video we have got an actual car feature and i know my hair looks like superman you don't need to tell me in the comments down below so today we have my main man dan's fiesta st down which i've kept saying for ages and ages and ages we'll film a video on it do something and then whilst i've been doing all my little cinematic shots i've realized there's actually more of the car than i ever thought there was so why don't you briefly just give us a quick overview rundown of like I guess you could say the main mods that this car's got because it has many, many mods. Yeah, well, so performance mod wise, it's running the BB04 from OC Motorsport uh, with their technically a stage 5 map, uh, which is equivalent to a stage 3. Um, so we've got the, obviously the turbo, it's got a billet actuator, um, it's got the AirTech big boost pipes, it's got the AirTech stage 3 induction kit and crossover, AirTech uh, stage 3 intercooler, AirTech quick spool manifold, that's pretty much it performance wise. and the uh, it's got the Forge external wastegate on it, which is sounds quite nice, you'll find out. Um, yeah, it's quite strange because usually everyone, you just put it onto the turbo, but this actually goes onto pretty much where the supposed elite would be on a big boost pipe kit, you bolt onto there. Which is quite different, but yeah. it works, so it works. Um, it's got the K-Sport 6 pot brake upgrade. Um, it's running on Pro Sport coilovers. They were gone for nothing, so yeah. upgraded soon. Coming soon. Yeah, um, it's got a fat wang. Yeah, it's got a big fat wang from AirTech on the back. Uh, it's got Sparco grid Q bucket seats with TRS harnesses. Um, and pretty much just your standard aesthetic mods, really. Yeah, grill. And you lost your front split like that, yeah, that, that decapitated. What sort of um, power has it got? Do you know roughly? Has it been on Dyno? So, at Devil Developments, it made 325 brake with 460 newton metres of torque. Yeah, and that's quite a renowned Dyno. That's like a very trustworthy one. Like, I know everyone's just about you're like happy roller dynos everywhere, but Devils is quite like a just a generic one. And I think your Fiesta ran the fastest that day out of the Fiesta, weren't it? Yeah, there was one other one which was an RT330 which made uh, 329. Yeah, but obviously it's just like yeah. minuscule differences. But that is still a very good rep to one, and it's a lot of torque to have in a Fiesta ST as well. So that's awesome as well. It's also got ADO8R semi stick tyres, and with weather like this, it's sort of perfect in the winter not so much so yeah pretty much all around this car is pretty much very much just track orientated it's got a massive oc motorsport livery across the rear quarter and it's got the air tech wing like i said with um an oc motorsport sticker on the wing plates and the exhaust is pretty interesting i rate right, this it's very different i think it's the new like outlaw one and it is literally looks like a bazooka and sounds like a bazooka yes, yes. and you've got like a, a deceleration map as well haven't you Yes, it's a, it's a safe crackle map really, it's not a proper diesel, so it does sound quite deep compared to like the Miltech sort of, so yeah. quite, quite nice sounding. Yeah, it's different, it's unique, I like it. And then also inside, we've got some bad boy pod pillar gauge where he's got his, um, you've got oil temp, your bar of boost and your water temperature, OMP, not a fake steering wheel with a quick boss. And then obviously the Sparco grid cues, and I was sitting in them because I have Sparco. I think it was the Rev my seat is or something like that. My back on it is very stiff, and I've like quite a lot of back problems and shit like that with hard seats. But sitting in these, they were sponges. Anything they were banging, so I need to find work and buy like some more foam for the back of my seat personally. But this isn't about my car. This is about Dan's car. So I'm going to now see what it's like. I haven't been in the stage 3 Fiesta in ages and I've never actually been in this one apart from like for a one minute trip to McDonald's once <laughs> when I was working my other Fiesta. So it'll be quite interesting to see as I haven't been in one in years and I do miss mine, that's why I put another one. So yeah, uh, we'll go out, we'll see what it's like and uh, have a good time. What's going on guys? So today's sponsor on this video is Pouch. Now you may be wondering what pouch is. Now pouch is literally everything you have always dreamed of having if you want to save money on them delicious car parts. Pouch is a completely free browser extension that automatically finds and applies discount codes when you're shopping online. So as you know, I've just bought a BMW 36 and I really want to do an oil change on it. So all I'm going to do is going to go on a website where I usually buy my oil. So now when I add it to basket, you'll see that pouch is actually automatically applying a discount code which will save me money just running through to see if there is one and it's found one and now it is going to save me some money now even if you don't want car parts this works on over 3,000 websites 
in the UK. Now, a lot of these other free browser extensions like what Pouch is, do not give you the UK based market and that is exactly what I'm guessing all my viewers want. So all it does, it takes two, three seconds to install, you install the browser completely free, it saves you money, so you're getting something for free that's saving you money, which means you have more money for more garbots. I strongly recommend it, it's quick, simple, easy, and it's free most of all. So yeah, make sure you go download that. Now, let's get back to the video, so just massive shout out to Pouch, go check them out. Soon, yeah. like there's so much on this car already, it can only get better. It's and like with, 
with these very all sort of driver orientated mods, there's not really mods on this that aren't necessary, apart from like a few things here and there, but that's what you just do for styling them, isn't it? Done the brake decision of letting me swap seats with him. Um, so this got short shift, you say? Yeah. Oh, that was nice. Let's do one as well. That's one. All right, let's go. Obviously, my arms, I do look like a little baby T Rex, but I can't help that. The boss is like really far out. The clutch is quite heavy. Yeah. Standard clutch. Is it? Yeah. Ooh, I like the little bit of turbo flutter. Obviously, because this is in my car, I don't want to be driving like a dickhead. And Dan will hurt me and my face if I drive like a dickhead. Drive like a dickhead all you want. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I don't want to have to pay the repair bills if something goes wrong. So just give me a golf and just that be even. Oh, I like the little turn bit. I'll find a little straight and then I'll get, get my foot in a little bit. Do you know what I mean? Pikachu. Pikachu. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? That's fucking nice. That's really nice, Dan. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah, I need to stay tuned. You, <laughs> you might need to drive my car when we get back because I feel like mine's like stuck in limbo. I don't know if it's just stand apart or what. Like the flutter, 
Fuck it in. The, the mixture between like the spool to the flutter to the bangs is just a perfect recipe. It's just like how you make the best brownies. <laughs> nice and gooey in the middle. Yeah, that's, this is all gooey in the middle, this car. This, this is like,
If you want to go follow Dan's Instagram at D7FMR. Wait, right for once. Oh, no, I'll practice <laughs> that. Link down below. Anything else you want to shout out? No, just obviously if you want to check out the setup I've got, just hit up OC Motorsport. But other than that, thank you all for watching. Hit a like, comment down below. These t shirts are now live on the website. Go grab them as well while you're there. And the lanyard. I've got lanyards on me because I was just carrying them. That's Dan's one, new one. There you go. Thanks, Tommy. See, good person I am. And yeah, hit the subscribe button. We're also close to 50k. Get me to 50k, please. Big reveal 50k. Ooh, big reveal. Thank you. See you next one. Peace.